This is a quick video that will talk you through setting notifications for Teams. You from the app that you have downloaded, the desktop app, go up to the top right hand corner and you'll see your silhouette or picture of you. If you click on that, I want you to choose settings. A settings window will open up and we are going to go to the notifications option on the left hand side and here where you can set all of your different notifications. There are some different options that you can do. Um, as you can see, if you're mentioned, so if there's the at and then your name, personally, you can choose to get a banner and an email, just a banner, which the banner is like your email notification that pops up in the bottom. It'll pop up a little banner telling that, or no notification and just show it in the feed. Those are the options that you have for pretty much all of these different settings. You can go through and choose which ones you feel are best for you and change those settings. And you can also always come back and do that. A couple of different ones. On the bottom it says email frequency. So if you choose email for any of these, you can choose how often you get the email. You can say as soon as something happens I want to get an email. Every 10 minutes, every hour, every day never however you want that to happen. Um, I choose every hour that's often enough if I don't see it in my screen. Now there's also something, oh, got a little too fast, where they talked about a follow channels. So if something changes in a follow channel you get a banner or an email right away. In order to follow any of your channels, so if you're a science teacher for instance you want to follow the science channel if you hover over it here in your course or in your navigation, local navigation, I click on the dots and I can choose to follow a channel. And then that was one that you will get notifications for. Okay, you can also, if you are following one, you can unfollow. Just quickly as well, if you are in a team or a channel, something new has happened, it will always show as bolded. So this, there's something has happened in this team that's bolded. So I can see in this channel something has changed. That's another quick way for you to be able to see changes that have happened in your team.